Well, the 2024 Women in Agribusiness Summit is set to kick off on September 24th in Denver, Colorado, bringing together women from across the ag value chain. Well, the Women in Agribusiness content manager, Janet Fisher, joins us now for more on this. What a pleasure to have you here. And I know this is a lot of hard work. I'm sure you're ready to get going on this. The 13th annual Women in Agribusiness Summit. So I got to ask you the secret to this uh, staying power of an event like this. Yeah, certainly. Well, thank you first for having me on. Um, yeah, 13 years. Uh, I think the staying power really comes from the fact that it, it's not just another event. It's not just a conference. It's a movement that instills confidence in women in agribusiness. And we provide, you know, a central connection place for women in the industry from early professionals to um, C-suite. So yeah. we've got staying power with sponsors and and with different companies that send large groups every year. Absolutely, Jen. I was going to say this event really helps give women a voice at the table. I mean, if we're being honest, right, women from the farm or their operation might not get to go to these big conferences, losing opportunities to network and get their say in agribusiness. So this conference really addresses that in a big way. Certainly does. Yes, that's our goal is to uh, advance women in the agribusiness industry and to showcase women on the stage as well, because we're here, we've got the knowledge, we've got the expertise, and and um, we're excited to um, highlight that. Well, I know, like I said, you put a lot of work into this event, as you do with all of them. Your job with Women in Agribusiness to create program agendas, recruiting speakers, you have done that once again this year. So can I ask you about the Temple Grandin evening? What's involved there? Yeah, we're very excited to have uh, Dr. Temple Grandin uh, involved with the event again. Um, she was involved back in 2018 when we were in Denver. So this year, um, the Monday night, the night before the uh, program kicks off, we have our members night out. So women in agribusiness members um, can join us on the CSU Spur campus for a screening of Temple's newest documentary, An Open Door. Uh, that'll be followed by a Q&A panel um, that Temple will be part of, and um, then a reception where she'll be signing her one of her newer books, Visual Thinking. Um, yeah, we're very excited to uh, bring our group to the CSU Spur campus and, and to have her involved again. Other speakers involved in topics that you're going to be covering during the summit? Certainly, yes, many topics. So uh, the themes that the agenda is loosely built around is uh, technology, especially AI and data, um, uh, sustainability, um, and communications. So uh, our keynote is going to be Dr. Alyssa Whitcraft, the executive director of the NASA Acres program. She'll be talking about the technology that NASA has used for, for many, many years to help the ag economy um, through you know, photo uh, photo data, GIS data, and the kinds of work that they're doing going forward. We'll have Mary Kay Thatcher of Syngenta uh, covering Fed policy and the Farm Bill, which is a big topic this year. And uh, we'll have other breakouts that focus around animal ag, um, sustainability in agribusiness and investments and how to ensure returns. And then a whole breakout on PR and reputation management in the day of social media. Boy, A to Z, you are yes. covering it all. A lot of women watching right now at home, they wanna get more information and of course, uh, possibly attend this summit that you're gonna be having in September. Womeninag.com, best place to go? Certainly. All right, yep. Janet, thank you so much. Great job, thank appreciate you. all you do. Thank you for joining us. Women in Agribusiness Content Manager, that is Janet Fisher.